Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Virgo, January 27, 2022. You could receive some rather strange phone calls today. One from a friend who is really thrilled about something and another from someone who could be really depressed over an upsetting turn of events. You might find it difficult to comment on either situation. So perhaps it's best just to provide a willing ear and let them talk. Tonight, take a brisk walk around your neighborhood. You might meet someone interesting. Though you might feel a bit inclined toward solitude today, don't indulge it. This is a great day to get out with friends and meet new people, particularly women. Closer bonds can be forged at this time, and you might possibly also make valuable business contacts, which can prove profitable in the future. Affectionate communications with a romantic partner can make your day. Take the evening out and enjoy a meal with someone close to you. You should be feeling like you have access to a greater than normal supply of energy today. Your tendency may be to work much harder than normal and accomplish a lot of things that might otherwise get pushed to the back burner for another day. That full inbox on your desk will be empty before you know it with the hard work you will get done today. You'll feel proud of your productivity and accomplishments when it's all over. Don't just get caught up in the rush of the day. You could have a feeling of acceleration, like time is flowing by too quickly. But if you can take a few minutes and breathe, you could have some important financial insights. Your analytical mind is processing lots of information now, and you could come up with some exciting concepts. Take moment to jot your thoughts down so that they aren't lost. Today is ideal for going on a long excursion with your friends. Take the initiative and organize a barbecue or picnic. Your friends will look forward to meeting up again to have a good chat and will show their gratitude to you. You'll all have a great time and have good memories of this special event. Someone at work, maybe a customer makes a big impression and leaves you gasping for air. It might not be appropriate, but it's a good chance to get some love in. Find your voice and don't miss this opportunity, maybe that special person you seek, your dream partner, is waiting for you to respond in a positive way. They seem eager to do everything possible to attract your attention and are set to make an appearance, don't allow a potential lover to leave you lost for words. The day's energy will bring a great deal of satisfaction into the lives of those Virgos who know how to fight for what they want. If you have had to muster up a lot of courage, willpower, and patience over the last few weeks to get one of your ideas across to other people, they will thank you for it today. Take advantage of the strategic position you are in to think ahead to some of the other ideas you have up your sleeve. They are probably just as brilliant as the first one. Rather philosophic and comprehensive, today you should try to bring your ideas on opening, natural authority, sense of duty and responsibility together in harmony. But to do this, you will definitely have to master your aggressiveness towards others. The hour of conciliation has come, if it hasn't, break UPS with one or more people who are close to you will be in the air. Be diplomatic. It has been said that you can never have too many friends, but today you might wonder if perhaps you do. Your phone could very well be ringing off the hook today. One person after another will be soliciting you for advice and for your famous shoulder to cry on. Be patient, one day you may need them to be there for you. Try to listen and to keep your sense of humor about you. When Mercury retrograde back out of your work sector and back into a fun, playful, romantic and creatively charged part of your chart yesterday this was a win slash win for both. For the first time since the sun's return to your work sector last week, this is a chance to put your full attention onto where you are going, without a need to have one eye on the rear view mirror. At the same time, Mercury has returned in time to make the most of Venus' final days in retrograde motion in a fun, playful, romantic and creatively charged part of your chart, with heart and mind now both focused on the past. At the same time that Mercury is spending his first full day back in your romantic sector after retrograding back in yesterday, Venus is just two days away from turning direct. With the planets that rule the heart and mind not only back together but both in retrograde motion, makes the next two days especially important when it comes to the doors open to the past and second chances or for just fully embracing a nostalgic trip down love's memory lane. The Leo moon faces off with expansive Jupiter this morning, 
bringing an abundance of attention your way. Feeling like all eyes are on you can be a little disconcerting, so it's important to remember that it's okay to put off answering messages or phone calls until you're feeling up to it. Luckily, things begin to feel more grounded and organized only a short time later and the moon changes signs into pragmatic Virgo. Use this energy to tap into your efficient side and knock out any correspondence or task you've been avoiding recently. Venus faces off with deceptive Neptune this evening, so things could get a little weird in romantic relationships. The energy here can cause us to inflict more damage than we realize in the moment, so try not to be overly critical or demanding of your partner or yourself right now. If you sense that someone is lying to you or gaslighting you, you might want to back away from the situation for a day or two so you can reflect privately and gain a clearer perspective on how you feel about the situation. This evening, feelings of restlessness are likely to manifest and the moon aligns with passionate Mars while entering a harsh T-square to the nodes of fate. Your desire for change could be supercharged, and you may feel passionate about getting ahead on your path, but issues from the past or uncertainty about the future could leave you feeling stuck. In the morning, the Leo moon opposes Jupiter in Aquarius, making us vulnerable to others' jealousies. In centering conversations around our own experiences, we can come off as showboat why. We are entirely naive to this, unable to see ourselves realistically and believing that we are making friends when we are really attracting people who want to see us knocked off our pedestal. We should be mindful of how we are presenting ourselves, as well as the company we are keeping. Perhaps it will be better to put off new introductions until later in the morning, as the moon enters its void following this aspect. We only get one chance to make a first impression, so we might as well hedge our bets. Two and a half hours later, the moon enters Virgo, ending its void of course. Over the next two days, our interests lie in organizing, restructuring, and perfecting our routines. Doing so gives us a feeling of emotional satisfaction, as if we are insulating ourselves from the disorganization and clutter of the outside world. The same attitude that enables us to tackle tedious mundane duties and also make us critical of others' choices or predispositions. Aim to stay on your own path and let others live their lives, you'll save more energy this way.